Hi everyone, welcome to my channel I Techniques. Today we are going to talk about proficiency in survival craft and rescue boat other than fast rescue boat. So watch this video till the very end. If you are new on this channel, please do subscribe and press the bell icon and don't forget to like this video. So without wasting any more time, let's start the video. So the first question is which EPUB transmits a distress alert that is received and relayed by an Inmarsat satellite? Class A EPUBs, Class B EPUBs, L band EPUBs, Category I EPUBs. So the answer is L band EPUBs. Question number two If a shark approaches you, option A aggressively paddle, you should panic, should not go out alone swim away so the answer is should not go out alone here it means when you abandon the ship you have to stay in a group question number three number of live boys in a passenger vessel more than 180 meters but less than 240 meters option a 18 option b 24 option c 30 option d 12 so the answer is 24 passenger vessel less than 60 meters should carry 8 less than 120 meters they should carry 12 less than 180 meters they should carry 18 and less than 240 meters they should carry 24 question number four a life raft shall be capable of withstanding an exposure when afloat in all sea conditions option a 15 days b 10 days c 60 days d 30 days so the right answer is 30 days in normal conditions in interior spaces the minimum sound pressure levels for broadcasting emergency announcement shall be 50 decibel 100 decibel 75 decibel none of the above so the answer is 75 decibel next question the liquid in the wet card compass is a mixture of distilled water and pure ethyl alcohol distilled water and isopropyl alcohol distilled water and methyl alcohol none of the above the answer is distilled water and pure ethyl alcohol question number seven luminous intensity of hand flares should not be less than option a fifteen thousand candela option b twenty thousand candela Option C, 25,000 candela. D, none of the above. So the correct answer is 15,000 candela. Moving on to the next question. The number 2 lifeboat on a vessel would be found. Option A, aft of number 1 lifeboat port side. Option B, aft of number 1 lifeboat starboard side. Option C, on the port side. Option D, on the starboard side. So the correct answer is on the port side the marine evacuation system shall be capable of transfer of persons from the ship within option a 5 minutes in the case of passenger ship option b 10 minutes in the case of passenger ship option c 20 minutes in the case of passenger ship option d 30 minutes in the case of passenger ship so the correct answer is 30 minutes in the case of passenger ship Question number 10. In normal condition, in exterior spaces, the minimum sound pressure levels for broadcasting emergency announcement shall be Option A, 50 decibel. Option B, 100 decibel. Option C, 75 decibel. Option D, 80 decibel. So the answer is 80 decibel. Moving on next. EPUB full form. Emergency position indicating radio beacon. Emergency position indicating radar beacon, emergency position information radio beacon, emergency people indication radio beacon. So the right answer is option A, emergency position indicating radio beacon. Question number 12. EPUB works on which satellite? Option A, Inmarsat. Option B, Cospas Satsat. Option C, none of the above. So the answer is Cospas Sarsat. Question number 13. Leo SAR stands for Option A. Low Economy Operational SAR. 
ऑप्शन बी लो अर्थ ऑर्बिटिंग सेटेलाइट फॉर सार ऑप्शन सी लाइट इमिटिंग सेटेलाइट ऑप्शन डी नन ऑफ द अब सो हियर इज द राइट आंसर ऑप्शन बी लो अर्थ ऑर्बिटिंग सेटेलाइट फॉर सार क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टीन विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग रिक्वायरमेंट्स फॉर इमर्शन सूट इज करेक्ट ऑप्शन ए डॉन इन टू मिनट्स ऑप्शन बी अलाउ द वियर टू जम्प फ्रॉम फोर पॉइंट फाइव मीटर्स ऑप्शन सी अलाउ द वियर टू क्लाइम डाउन अ वर्टिकल लैडर ऑफ फाइव मीटर्स डी ऑल ऑफ द अबो हियर वी कैन सी ऑप्शन ए बी एन सी दे ऑल आर करेक्ट सो द आंसर विल बी डी ऑल ऑफ द अब क्वेश्चन नंबर फिफ्टीन द नंबर ऑफ लाइफ बॉयज ऑन अ कार्गो शिप ऑफ लेंथ लेस देन हंड्रेड मीटर इज ऑप्शन ए एट ऑप्शन बी सिक्स ऑप्शन सी फोर ऑप्शन डी टेन सो द राइट आंसर इज ऑप्शन ए एट मूविंग ऑन नेक्स्ट द डॉनिंग टाइम फॉर द इमोशन सूट इज टू मिनट्स फाइव मिनट्स थ्री मिनट्स वन मिनट So the option A is correct. Two minutes. Next question: How should the painter of a life raft which is fitted with hydrostatic release be secured to the ship? Option A: Secured via a weak link to a secured point on the ship. Option B: Secured to the part of hydrostatic release that is designed to break free. Option C: It should not be secured anyway. Option D: Directly to a secured point on the ship. so answer will be option a secured via a weak link to a secured point on the ship question number 18 which one of the listed requirements regarding the buoyant smoke signal does not correspond to present regulation the buoyant smoke signal shall option a emit smoke for at least 3 minutes when floating in calm water option b continue to emit smoke when submerged in water for a period of 10 second inside 10 cm of water C not be swamped in a seaway option D give a bright red light during the entire emission time so the answer is option D give a bright red light during the entire emission time next question answering signal made by life saving stations when signals are seen from a ship by night r option A parachute rocket option B hand flare C black ball and d 3 white star so the answer is d 3 white stars question number 20 checking and servicing of life raft as per pms is option a once a year option b twice a year option c once in 5 years option d based on condition of life raft so as per solas option a once a year Question number twenty-one. Before lifting a lifeboat from water, it should be ensured that option A, bottom plug is secured tight. Option B, false wires clear and secured tightly. Option C, engine is going astern. Option D, sea anchor is streamed. The answer is option B, false wires clear and secured tightly. Moving on next, how can the SARS audible tone monitor be used? Option A, it informs survivors that. assistance may be nearby option b it informs survivors when the battery's charge condition has weakened option c it informs survivors when the sard switches to the standby mode option d it informs survivors that nearby vessel is signaling on dsc so the answer is option a it informs survivors that assistance may be nearby question number 23 an inflatable life raft is thrown into the water from a sinking vessel what should occur after the painter trips the co2 bottle to inflate the raft option a the sea anchor should be deployed as soon as you are away from the vessel option b the floor will automatically inflate option c if upside down the craft will right itself option d the painter will detach from the raft and the answer is option a the sea anchor should be deployed as soon as you are away from the vessel question number 24 which one of the routine tests and inspection of lsa is not required by regulation not required by regulation option a lifeboat engine to be run for at least 3 minutes every week 
Option B is survival craft and rescue boats with launching appliances shall be visually inspected weekly. Option C, inspection of lifeboat equipment shall be carried out monthly. Option D, general emergency alarm to be tested daily. Here we have to choose the option which is not required by regulation. So the option D is correct. General emergency alarm to be tested daily. Question number 25. Sea sickness is caused by rolling and rocking motion which affects fluid in the Option A. Stomach B. Lower intestine C. Inner ear D. Bladder So the answer is inner ear Question number 26. If water is rising in the bilge of survival craft, you should first Option A. Abandon the survival craft B. Check for cracks in the hull. C. Shift all personnel to the stern. Option D. Check the bilge drain plug. So the correct answer is check the bilge drain plug. Moving on next, IMSR provide guidelines for a common aviation and maritime approach to organizing and providing dash services. Option A. Oil spill cleanup. Option B, search and rescue. Option C, salvage. Search and rescue services they are providing. So the answer is search and rescue. Question number 28. The function of hydrostatic release unit is Option A, substitute for limit switch of gravity debit. Option B, to automatically unhook the lashing and release the life raft when the ship sinks. Option C, for releasing life raft in bad weather. Option D for releasing lifeboat from sinking vessel. So here is the answer. Option B to automatically unhook the lashing and release the life raft when the ship sinks. Next question. In a free fall lifeboat instead of immersion suit, TPAs are provided to all persons. True or false? So the answer is B. False. Here's the last question. Hand flares burn with bright red color. Option A, true. B, false. So the answer is option A, true. I hope this video will be beneficial for everyone. So if you like this video, please hit the like button and if you are new on this channel please do subscribe and press the bell icon and share this video as much as you can see you next video till then goodbye